Hi, I'm Bonnie Browning from the American Quilter Society, and today I have with me Christine Wickard, who is one of our winners. Christine comes from Penfield, New York. New York, thank you. Yeah. And what a magnificent quilt you made, Christine. Thank you. Uh, tell us a little bit about the making of this quilt. Well, it turned out to be a quilt that I made um, using a Ginny Beyer fabric called Monticello. And it was a simple basket quilt, strippy quilt, um, and I used all of her fabric lines plus lots and lots and lots of my own fabrics. And then I finished it, and then I had quilted it, and I had nothing to hand quilt. So then I decided to stuff the back of the quilt, and that's what you're seeing right now. Yes, and, and you know, I have, to tell, I have to tell our audience a little story, because as the crew was hanging the quilts, they said to me, Bonnie, quilt number 325 doesn't have a sleeve on it. <laughs> she put the sleeve on and matched it so well on the back side that they didn't know there was a sleeve there. Uh, we found it, though, and we're able to hang it. Yeah. Um, okay, and of course, it's all hand quilted. It is, yeah. And uh, we're going to show them a little bit of the back so that they can see uh, how beautiful the back is because it's, it's a beautiful print on the back side. Right. Okay, you know, everyone always wants to know how long did it take? <laughs> Everybody asks me too. I have many things going at the same time. Uh, probably it, it, with the stuffing about a year. A year. Mm -hmm. Well, and so that's probably about average for someone when they're making a quilt this size, right? I think so. I think okay, so. well, congratulations, Christine. And we're thrilled to have your quilt here in the contest this year. And I'm thrilled to be here and win too. Okay, thanks. Thank you.